Hello, I'm Jason Wild. Today I'm going to share you some information pertaining to Kevlar. I'm going to talk about some key features of Kevlar. I will go over the history of Kevlar, which is interesting, and hopefully you find it unique compared to other materials that have been widely integrated into our society. After, I will discuss some of its mechanical properties, and finally I will discuss Kevlar as a military-grade product. So what is Kevlar? Kevlar is a product that you may have heard but not necessarily know about in detail. Kevlar is a fiber which can be woven into layers, and it can be used in many ways. It is actually found all around us. It is used in an abundance of products like clothing, car parts such as tires, and military-grade equipment, commonly known as body armor. So a little background. Kevlar was developed by the DuPont Company, which specializes in synthetic materials. The company focuses on materials such as nylon, polyester, and spandex. More specifically, Kevlar was invented in 1965 by DuPont's researcher, Stephine Kolek. She joined DuPont right after World War II in 1946. It took Stephine two decades before she would create one of the world's most versatile materials and along with a new division of polymer chemistry. Kolek's research of the fibers tensile strength, elongation at break, and stiffness confirmed that she had created an fretable material. Collect's research would result in an immediate expansion to the program. The company would release modern Kevlar as we know it in 1971, uh, and the material is highly praised for its strength and would be used in many different applications. Due to Collect's research, there's now 200 applications for Kevlar. It ranges from airplane parts to fire resistant gloves and boots. Now, Kevlar has many mechanical properties. Some of its properties are a high tensile strength and a high resistance to heat. Kevlar also comes in various types. For example, there is Kevlar 29, Kevlar 49, and Kevlar 149 which have different properties for different applications. When we compare Kevlar 29 to Kevlar 49, Kevlar 29 has a tensile modulus of 12 million PSI, while Kevlar 49 has a tensile modulus of 18 million PSI. However, both types of Kevlar have the same tensile strength of over 500,000 PSI. This high tensile strength makes Kevlar stronger than steel, which on average has a tensile strength of 61,000 PSI. Kevlar is not known to melt or drip, but will instead burn or disintegrate when the temperatures reach higher than 800 degrees Fahrenheit. These two remarkable properties of Kevlar make the material such a great component for many parts and clothing dealing with high heat. Kevlar is most likely known for its application in body armor. The material's high tensile strength and ability to be weaved like clothing makes Kevlar perfect for body armor. Kevlar has been a main component for armor since the 1980s. Though Kevlar is bullet resistant, uh, it should be noted that Kevlar is not bulletproof. Kevlar's performance makes it classified as a soft armor, which makes Kevlar highly effective at resisting low-velocity bullets, low-velocity bullets like most pistol rounds, and even shrapnel can be defeated by Kevlar. High-velocity bullets, especially bullets from most rifles, can easily defeat Kevlar. Though when Kevlar was introduced, Militaries around the world demanded weaponry that could defeat Kevlar, as pistol rounds were inefficient to defeat Kevlar. The response was new personal defense weapons, or PDWs. 
that used high-velocity rounds that could defeat soft armors like Kevlar. Nowadays, Kevlar is easily accessible and used as an armor for police use, and DuPont even keeps a record of the number of police saved from death or serious injury by wearing body armor. Kevlar in militaries is usually used along with metal or ceramic plates that can resist, uh, resist higher velocity bullets. Overall, it can be said that Kevlar has revolutionized the body armor industry. Kevlar is an incredibly unique fiber, which is why it's used in many different applications. Tires, aircraft, body armor, heat and cut resistant clothing all benefit from the strength that Kevlar provides. I do hope that you learn something interesting and can appreciate the one-of-a-kind material that is Kevlar.